2008 to 2011, James Finch racked up several small charges, shoplifting, traffic citations, and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. And throughout several criminal complaints we obtained, Finch seemed to have a problem with drugs. He was ordered to complete the addictions treatment program at the MDC in order to be released from jail. In March, records show Finch faced charges of battery on a household member and assault against a household member. A criminal complaint shows he and his father got into a fight about him not being allowed to stay at their home. He was set for trial and put on pretrial supervision. Then he was arrested at the end of July for criminal trespass, failing to appear in court for a traffic arraignment, and failure to comply with conditions of release. Also in 2013, Finch racked up two false imprisonment charges and another battery against a household member. But Finch's latest charge happened in March of this year. According to jail records and the district attorney's office, he assaulted a household member and faced a charge of false imprisonment. The state asked for 364 days of supervised probation, but he only served 87 because he was given credit for the 277 days he served in custody. Finch was released on August 20th. According to the Albuquerque Journal, on the 21st, Finch's father told police his son dug a hole in their backyard and he thought it was to symbolize him and his wife's graves. Then Monday, police tell us Finch went to his parents' home, killing his father and critically injuring his mother.